So when making a leaflet, the first thing to decide is how you want to fold it. So look at this piece of paper here. If I fold it in thirds and make this be the front, and then I fold this one inside, right? And then this is the back. And let's look at what else we've got. What we have to decide is, when you open the leaflet, obviously this is page one, do you want this to be page two or not? Do you want this to be page two? And then this will be three. And on the other side, you have back and front and this other one. So maybe this should be four, right? So you have, when you set up your document on the computer, you have four back front in that order on one side of the paper, and you have one, two, three on the other side, and this is the inside of the leaflet when it's unfolded. Now there's another way to do it, so just let's just look at that one. Um, that's to fold, again, fold the front the same way. Again, let's write front. Now, this side doesn't have to fold in like we did just now. It could fold behind. All right. Let's have a look. What see what I mean? I made it like a like an accordion or whatever that's called. So let's go and write back here. Then I've got front. Turn over. One. Two. Notice it doesn't open up into three um, a three panel inside like the other um, fold does. One, two are together, and then I turn over. It's the back, and then here are three and four. So if I do open up the page, it's three, four, and front on one side of the paper, and it's one, two, and back on the other side of the paper. So you have to decide which fold is good for your brochure. The one I'm going to show you is how to make is the first one, where it goes front, and then when you open up the inside, you have one, two, three, and then four comes before the back. This is a sketch of how I want the paper to look. The red lines show where I'm going to fold it, and on each panel I have a frame with a one centimeter margin all around. This is the size of A4 paper, and you can pause if you want to see these calculations, which show how to space out the frames equally. This is the important information we need for the next video.